Peace, everybody. Welcome to Capital Combat. The name says it all. I'm Hakeem Branch, and I'm coming at you with a quick counter. Today, I'm going to be discussing tonight's UFC 193, which is coming at us in Australia. Um, I think it's the first event they've had there. They're having it at a huge uh, soccer stadium. It's going to be thousands, tens of thousands of fans there. It's going to be an electric night. And we have two title fights on this card. And it's going to be very unprecedented because it's going to be two female title fights. Uh, I think it's going to be the first time that this has happened uh, in the UFC. So the first one, we got the strawweight champion, uh, Joanna Jurczyk. I murdered that. Very hard to pronounce. But she's taking on Valerie Letourneau. And also we have the bantamweight champ, Ronda Rousey, against Holly Holm. Now I'm going to start off with the straw weight fight. Uh and your chaser, uh yeah. You have a very very skilled stand up fighter with very good takedown defense against Laterno who is a very tough very capable challenger but probably not quite ready to take on the champ. Um I see this one being pretty one-sided unless Laterno puts in the performance of her career and shocks the world. And honestly, that's the same thing we're going to get in the main event as well. As much as they try to hype this up, they really don't have any competition for Ronda Rousey at the moment. Um, and it's going to be a long time to find any competition for her because she, unlike most of the competitors in uh, the UFC and female martial arts in general, she's a lifelong competitor of judo and is taken very well to boxing as well. And she's getting better. It's still She has a long way to go. But she always has that very extensive judo background to fall back on and she knows how to use her boxing to capitalize on her judo which makes her pretty much unstoppable to any female in that division now with home you have something that's a little opposite she has pretty much been a stand-up competitor her entire life uh, she's a multiple-time kickboxing champion, and she's a multiple-time boxing champion. So if this was a boxing match, I would take Holly home hands down, without a doubt. Unfortunately, there's going to be some grappling involved. And unless she can turn and point Ronda Rousey all night, it's only a matter of time before she gets her hands on her, puts her on her back, and puts her in the arm bar. Probably within two rounds. Uh, Home does have exquisite footwork. Uh, she has decent enough power to keep you off of her. But I don't think she's going to be able to do that for 25 minutes. I'd love to see it. And honestly, I probably will be rooting for her because I followed her career for a long time. But Rousey just cannot be denied right now. So that's who I'm going with. I'm going with Ronda. I will be rooting for Holly. I hope she makes a very good account of herself. Maybe even pull off the upset. I just don't see it happening. Um, what about you guys? What do you think? Hit me up in the comments and let me know. That's all I got. Keeping this nice and quick. Make sure you like this video. If you haven't subscribed yet, do that. Hit us up on Facebook, Instagram, Google+, or the email, Capital Combat. Email is at Gmail. So, we look forward to seeing you in the next video. And I'll catch you then. Peace. One, and you've already lost They don't seem to see that everything we've done is coming and gone My fists are on fire I perform till I perspire
my demons are in a rage Keep thinking that it's a game I kick rhyme hurricane I told them I don't play I'm liquid the Black Street Fighter Street Fighter Street Fighter